when archaeologists uncovered these 3,500 year old skeletons what they saw left them gobsmacked in the wilds of Siberia a team of archaeologists is hard at work uncovering the graves of an ancient civilization slowly the secrets of their burials are exposed for the first time in thousands of years but when the graves are opened a shocking revelation is hidden within Staryi Tartus is a village in Novosibirsk a region of southern Russia part of Western Siberia It's an area of little appeal to tourists for archaeologists. However, it's a completely different story in ancient times The area around the village was popular site for burials It was so popular in fact that as many as 600 graves and tombs have been located in the vicinity and now their mysteries have begun to see the light of day the burial sites are thought to date to the time of the so-called Andro Novo culture a catch-all term for several different but related cultures that existed in Western Siberia during the Bronze Age by and large they flourished between 3,000 and 4,000 years ago but back to the present day in 2013 archaeologists from various European and Russian scientific institutes were conducting excavations at some of the grave sites and what they subsequently found would transform their understanding of how the Andronova cultures buried their dead in a significant number of tombs archaeologists discovered the remains of couples who'd been buried together side by side but it was how their bones had been arranged that was the most surprising thing the skeletal inhabitants of dozens of tombs had each been arranged so that they appeared to be embracing each other or as writer Vasily Lebetsky subsequently wrote for the Institute of Archaeology and Ethnography of the Siberian branch of the Russian Academy of Sciences they'd been positioned in post-mortal hugs with bony hands clasped together in addition archaeologists found various artifacts alongside the bodies yes quantities of pottery weapons and bronze ornaments were found within the graves while pits containing animal bones were also discovered in the surrounding area of course it's not unusual for couples to choose to be buried together with a widow or widower joining their partner in a shared grave once their time comes but what made the discovery of these skeletons particularly creepy is the experts belief that they belong to people who were buried at the same time now it's unlikely that the members of any couple would pass away in unison at least not of natural causes so what was the story behind the bizarre burials of star Tartus? Well, for one thing, archaeologists have been able to identify the burials as belonging to the Andronovo culture thanks to their positioning of the bodies. Why? Because while natives to the region buried their dead flat on their backs, the incoming Andronovo people buried them on their sides, if they actually buried them at all. More typically, people from the Andronovo culture were cremated, which raises even more questions as to the nature of these shared graves. And although no definitive answers have been found, archaeologists have offered up several possible explanations. We can fantasize a lot about this. Professor Vyacheslav Molodin of the Institute of Archaeology and Ethnography of the Siberian branch of the Russian Academy of Sciences, pictured here, told the Siberian Times. We can allege that the husband died and the wife was killed to be interned with him, as we see in some Scythian burials. Meanwhile, Professor Lev Klein from St. Petersburg State University has suggested the unusual arrangements could be the result of practices similar to the Hindu ritual of Diksha. Rooted in beliefs about reincarnation and death as a second birth, such rites sometimes involved ritualistic sexual acts. Perhaps in the pre-Vedic period, Klein told the Siberian Times, relatives of the deceased often sought to reproduce the Diksha posthumously and simulated sexual intercourse in the grave. Now, intriguingly, Diksha developed on the Indian subcontinent some 3,000 miles from Staryi Tartus. But some experts believe that Andronova people originally hailed from Iran and could have brought their ritualistic beliefs with them. Meanwhile, the mysterious couple's graves weren't the only joint burials to be uncovered at the archaeological site. Indeed, researchers also found a man and a child entombed together, and similarly, a woman and a child. What is the degree of their kinship? Moladeen pondered. Are they father and son or the same question arises when a woman and a child are found it should seem obvious She's the mother, but it may not be so she could be an aunt or not a relative at all In order to solve these questions Mola Dean and his colleagues are turning to the emerging science of paleogenetics By analyzing the remains the team hoped to be able to determine what if any kinship existed between two people interred in the same grave 
According to the Siberian Times, Moladeen hoped to see results within 5 to 10 years of the discovery in 2013. So for those intrigued by the notion of lovers locked forever in an internal embrace, there may even be more of this fascinating story to come. Please don't forget to share this video with your friends below. Please don't forget to subscribe and activate the bell to receive everything that's new.